Hello everyone, welcome back to Sharp Star Optics. Today we will mainly demonstrate how to use computer to control Max3. Max3 connects computers in two ways, wireless connection and wild connection. Wild connections are using a USB cable and wireless connections are using Wi-Fi. When the hand controller is started, use the computer's Wi-Fi connection to find the actual mount's Wi-Fi. Usually, the factory setting Wi-Fi name is on step. Connect the Wi-Fi or USB, the computer is now connected to the Max3. Open the browser and enter the URL 192.168.0.1. Click the last option, Wi-Fi, enter the Wi-Fi password P-A-S-S-W-O-R-D and then can enter to change the Wi-Fi name and the password. We recommend changing your Wi-Fi name and password before using Max3 to prevent others from connecting by mistake. Certainly, this page is suitable for all kinds of wireless connection and you can also modify it on the page with a mobile phone. Download ASCOM driver and ASCOM software from the official website before the first time you use mount. I will put the link at the bottom of the video. If your system is Windows 10, you need to install these two drivers. And if it is Windows 7, you also need to install this USB driver. Here we will use a NINA software as a demonstration. Open the NINA. Choose Telescope. After you choose the OnStep Telescope option, click on the Settings option of Geo logo. In the settings, there will be parameters of Max3. If you are using a wireless connection, select IP address here and fill in the IP address 192.168.1.9.0.1. If it is a USB connection, then choose the COM interface here. Here is a setting button for latitude and longitude. Latitude and longitude are adjusted according to your location. UFT is adjusted according to your time zone. For example, if it is UTC plus 8, then fill in minus 8 here. If it's in UTC minus 6, then fill in the plus 6 here. Here it says set date or time on connect. You can take it to synchronize the time of the Victoria Mount with your computer time. The following restrictions cannot be adjusted. You may just choose default. Click OK. Click connect to connect the mount. After observing or shooting with actor mount, adjust it back to the home position. Go back to the page of mount, click home to go back to the home position. Now the tracking is stopped. If you want it to continue working, click the set tracking rate and choose sidereal, then click the set tracking rate again. Now the tracking is back to work. Let's have a look at how to connect PHD2. Open PHD2. Choose the connection equipment. Choose our step telescope for the mount. In the same way, click GR setting and then click to connect. Now PHD2 is connected to Max3. Open the advanced setup, select the random mode in the desert setting. Take the use multiple star in the guider settings. We recommend the minimum movement distance of Max3 to be set between 0.01 to 0.1. These parameters can be used as a reference to achieve the best guiding effect. 
Later, we will have more videos on how to use the Max 3. Thanks for watching.